What's up everyone? Welcome to the behind the scenes of Morrow's Nightmare. This is basically going to be a video of us showing you guys what we did to create the event, everything that went behind making it happen. Uh, by the time of you guys seeing this, the event will be over and had happened already. Um, but yeah, so we decided to show you guys over the next couple minutes of basically what went into everything. Um, so yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy it. The whole process took about just a little under two months. Well, obviously, it's only going to take a few minutes for you guys, but it's been, it's going to be it's going to be rough. Today is basically day one, so to speak. So so far, not a lot has been done, but we're getting there. As you can see, we got a bunch of stuff sort of kind of laid out for some stuff. Got a bunch of props, building shit, all kinds of stuff. So right now, as you can see, like I said, there's really not much so far, but. Obviously, if you guys had been to the event, hopefully you had fun. Uh, and you can see how different it looks like now as opposed to what it looks like. Or what it looked like built. Way back there is where Stitch was. So you guys can basically see how bare everything is. But we're getting there. Got some stuff ready. It's going to be a very, very long two months, but this place is going to look very different very soon. What's up everybody? So today is audition day. One of the audition days. We're going to have today and tomorrow. It's been about, I want to say a week and a half, maybe two weeks. Um, and we've got quite a bit done actually. More than I was anticipating, but you guys remember we were setting this tent up last time. We also have the start of the facade for the vampire junkyard. We got the clown house. It's coming along guys. Still haven't really done much on, on Stitch just yet, but we're getting there. You guys wanna go take a walk through real quick? Let's check it out. Boom, look at this. This is still active. Construction, of course. You guys are getting a look of how different it looks now as opposed to when it's all said and done. There's some more stuff back there. It's going to go all through back here. It's going to look good. It'll be spooky. Some more fencing. Clown house. So this is, what day is today? I think the 30th, August 30th. This is being recorded currently. It's very red. I like, this place is kind of cool during the day because this tent has like this red glare to everything. It's kind of cool. Won't look like that for the actual house, unfortunately, but. And boom, put all this space back here. It's the back of Vampire. And then some more old disgusting wood it's been raining a lot lately so it's been kind of hard to really get a lot done we'd obviously like to be a little bit further than what we are now but we're coming along we have auditions today like i said and tomorrow it's gonna be in that tent oh, wow look at that right there we go um it's gonna be in that tent And then after that, we have a small media preview on the 12th. And then October 2nd, we start. So you guys will definitely see more updates coming up. So stay tuned. So uh, last thing you guys saw was our audition day, uh, which did not go very well um, because we got rained out. It's a little bit unfortunate, but that's OK, because we ended up doing uh, virtual auditions which went fantastic we have everyone cast now um i'm filming this like a few weeks before uh we open um so it's been quite quite some time since i've been here well since i filmed at least uh we got a lot done so i'm going to show you guys what all has been done so far um this big sign right here is going to be the sign that uh shelby is going to be painting which i'm excited for I'm excited to see what she's going to do 
pretty cool. And then we're under the big tent, which this is where all the pumpkins that you guys are going to be able to, and photo ops and stuff, but all the pumpkins you guys are going to be able to get and take a look at and all that stuff will be all throughout here. And then since I think the last time this was uh, where the dark was going to be, it has since moved to down there behind that little trailer. I'll show you guys. But yeah, let's take a look around show you guys everything that's been going on and yeah also normally whenever I film videos I kind of edit them make them look a little bit decent uh, for this for this but I'm, I'm not really gonna do that I'm just gonna kind of show you guys as I go uh, I'm gonna go down there to stitch really quick while the Sun is still out that way you guys can kind of see that just a little bit we're also doing uh, light lighting and audio testing tonight so I'll probably get some film and footage of that stuff. Also, fun fact, if you guys want to know one of the biggest obstacles for us for building all this, is this right here. See all this? This nice little muddy water. So imagine this, except the entire lot. Not fun. It has been pretty much raining every single day since our, our, our auditions. Today's the first day I want to say that we've been out here and it hasn't rained profusely so it's kind of nice I'm glad that it hasn't rained because it's been quite frustrating very difficult to get stuff built so right now this isn't built out yet but this is gonna be the dark it's a very small experience as if you guys have gone, have went through it you would have you have known but hopefully a very good experience for you guys and then this is how much we've gotten done with stitch so far obviously it's not just that it goes back <laughs> quite a while but yeah come in through here and if you guys have been through the event you'll know what all this was but this is what it looks like bare and not complete completely different looking we spent a lot of uh, time today aging a lot of this wood all this wood did not look like how it does now at the beginning of today I should have done like a before and after thing but it was tired or it was early I was tired wasn't really feeling it so that's why but this is kind of what the bare bones looks like guys also laser swamp scene tons of fun and fun fact if you guys don't do the tour the daytime tour that we're gonna have right back here is where all the actors are gonna be hanging out and stuff we're going to be cutting out at a, an employee entrance right over there. And uh, this is basically where they'll be. Right before they uh, head out on set and get ready to come out and scare everybody. Very cool. This, uh, if you guys haven't seen us talk about the event at all, this is Kira and I's kind of a child. The one that we are basically putting all of our work into uh, alone, so to speak. So... Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Hopefully we did a good job. All in all, we're doing this for fun. Something that was uh, very new to us. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We did a good job. We were able to entertain you guys because that's what we like to do. All right, let's go take a look at the clown house, guys. It's going to be interesting to, because this is going to be posted obviously after the event. So you guys will see how different it looks Let's see I don't know what it's gonna look I mean I know what it's gonna look like but I haven't seen the final product yet you guys have this guy's gonna be cool I'm excited for this guy and like I said we're a few weeks before opening we have quite a lot done but we still have a lot more to do not really too stressed about it But yeah, hopefully everyone has been excited to come. And like I said, you guys had a good time and enjoyed it. Um, if I haven't spoken to any of you guys uh, that watcher that are watching this, feel free to comment down below and let us know what your favorite part of the event was, if you liked it, or if you didn't like it. I don't know. I don't care. Just let me know what you thought. I'm gonna see if we can put a dead body on this. I don't know. 
we might. And this is gonna be a cool scene. We're testing this later on tonight, and I'm very excited because if it works, it's gonna be really cool. Obviously, you guys will know what it is, but yeah. And not this probably won't be here. It'll be something like this, but if we pull off what we want this to be, you guys will see it. If not, it was supposed to be a spider clown. We'll see. Who knows? And then there's this this wonderful guy. All these barrels. Hopefully you guys are enjoying seeing how bare bones this is and how different it is uh, as opposed to actual Operation Night. These guys are cool. And I like these guys. I kind of want to keep these for after the season. And then we are going to go check out Vampire Junkyard, where Josh is still working on it, actually. Like, we're doing, so this is what we're doing the audio and lighting testing for, is this tonight, as well as the clown one. It's gonna be tons of fun. What you working on? Hmm? Say what you working on. Speakers. Speakers. Wow. We're gonna have it like so high that it busts people's eardrums. That's the real horror, right? Neighbors call. <laughs> call the cops. <laughs> That's a cool scene. Oh man. This will obviously be very different. Also, fun fact, guys, it is miserably hot out. It is not. It's like I think right now it's like five, five thirty, and it's still extremely hot. This scene, well, I've got some speakers up there right now. This scene is gonna be a pretty funny scene. And if you guys have been through the haunt, you'll know what this is. Very, this was, this was the one thing I was excited for the most and trying to get to happen, uh, which is basically a slider scare. But you don't really see, obviously you people only see sliders at um, Hello Scream and Knots and all that stuff. And that, a lot of, that, that, that scare doesn't really get put into houses, I've, at least I, not that I've seen. And this was something that I, I thought up of and I was really hoping we could pull off. Uh, and we're still at the right, right, as of right now, we don't know if, it, if it'll work. I, we think it will. So this is either gonna be the slider scare or a zipline scare. Hopefully it is the slider scare. So I'm really, cause it, it's, a, it, it's an element that, like I said, not a lot of people are going to expect, especially in an outdoor trail uh, and haunt. So hopefully, this is gonna be the slider scare and hopefully you guys love seeing it because this is something I really want to get pulled off. Um, so hope, I think we're gonna test it sometime uh, next week, I think. Hopefully, obviously this, is, this stuff's gonna be all touched up with more blood and all that stuff soon, pretty soon too. This is gonna be, so this is the other side of, this, of the, the slider scare. So the person that's gonna be here is going to run, slide it. Actually, I can show you guys. Let's see, let's take a, let's take a little detour. So yeah, essentially this is gonna be covered up with some uh, plywood and then a, or putting a, kind of like this plastic, um, kind of, it's hard to explain, but it's like a plastic, it's very slippery, we're gonna have them slide on. The person's gonna run, so it's not going to be on top of pilots, obviously. We're going to put plywood down. They're going to run, and they're going to slide at the people walking this way, kind of across from them. They'll have a fence in between them and the, and the guests, which is going to be nice. And they'll disappear behind this. And then as the people walk through here, like we just did, they'll be walking around, they'll come around, and then by the time they get back here, the person who is here sliding will have reset, and we'll be hiding here, waiting for the people to come back out and scare them again. So they get two scares for the price of one person. Love it. Okay, all right. Let's continue on. So you'll continue after that. You'll come through here. 
there was a scare that I don't know if we're gonna get to do. But for this one, and this is the exit, you walk out. And yeah. Um, but yeah, there is a scare that uh, I really wanted to do, and I don't know if we're gonna get to do it or not. But I'll tell you it just in case we don't get to do it, but it's a refrigerator scare. I wanted to put a scare actor inside of a refrigerator and obviously put the um, cut out the back of the refrigerator that way there's not actually someone just sitting in a refrigerator waiting that way they can run up behind it push the door out and I wanted someone to because of it you know obviously being a junkyard theme I wanted them to push the door out jump out at the people obviously from a safe distance with the door flying out and everything so hopefully we can still do that if not at some point in time I will make that scare happen somewhere. Who knows? But that's it for now. Uh, I'm gonna let the sun go down. I'm gonna go continue working on putting some of the uh, audio up, getting some of the lighting ready. And then uh, obviously, if you guys have watched us before, my camera sucks, so you know how it is at night. But hopefully I can show you guys some stuff later on tonight with the audio and the uh, lighting, everything like that, so yeah. Opening night is coming up very soon. We have all of our actors hired. Uh, I think two, a week and a half from now, we have rehearsals. Uh, maybe I'll bring the camera out for that or something. Who knows? Um, yeah, and then opening night is also the media night. It'll be tons of fun. Super exhausting. It's been fun so far. I am excited to have everything finished and done with. It's a very, very exhausting uh, task has been brought upon but tons of fun wouldn't have traded it for the world so yeah check it out Look how creepy this looks such a cool uh facade entrance i like it if you guys saw the promo video for this i've already seen this but thank you yeah. kind of see the lasers back there uh we did a few uh, we already did, like set up some of the sound and stuff but i can't show you because it's uh, copyrighted music and I uh, don't want a copyright strike on a very ridiculous and pointless video. So check this out. This is this is so cool. They make noise. Also, but oh, there we go. Dude, this is gonna look fucking cool. Like. Especially when the, the music starts playing too. See that music I can probably show you guys because it's not copyrighted, so. Also, also, I hope you guys like this effect because this is this is cool. It's the first time we're testing this thing at night and I am excited. Uh, we're gonna we don't have a roof on it yet. But we're gonna put it. That's cool though. Seeing this with fog and seeing the eye at the end is gonna be awesome. But see what I mean, guys? Look how dark this is. I need to get a new camera. This thing is, this thing is uh, running its course. I need to get a better low light camera. Let's walk through. This thing is dark. I'm excited. Excited to see this stuff, guys. Just turned the fog machine on. Look how cool this is going to look. Sweet smell of fog. I love it. Dude, this is cool. <laughs> this is gonna look so badass. I'm far enough away so you probably can hear the music, but this is what vampire looks like from the outside and sounds like. We just went through and it's fucking terrifying. I cannot wait to see it like, I feel like we need to pull more in actual operation with actors and stuff. Now we gotta light this guy. Again, the lights aren't up yet for this, but we're gonna have a whole bunch of cool lights in the front here. Obviously, you guys, obviously you guys will have, have already seen, but hopefully you guys dig this. The wind knocked him over, but looks a lot different at night. There's no obnoxious orange glow. <clears throat> but yeah guys like I said this is uh, <clears throat> the 
few weeks before uh, we open. Still quite a bit to do, but not too much. This is going to be cool. I'm excited to actually get this, this little area finished. I like the look with this little flashlight. This is cool. This is creepy. You can't even see anything. This is just black walls. This is what it looks like without the uh, laser effect. Like, you, you guys literally can't even see anything. This is a doorway. See it? This camera's terrible. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> but, yeah. We're about to head out for the night. Now that we got all the lighting and everything tested, check this out. It's cool, right? But, yeah, guys. Hopefully, you guys have been enjoying the behind the scenes video. Probably film just a little bit more before uh, we actually open. I don't know if this is like scary story times. I don't know if we will uh, film whenever we actually open up. Uh, just because we'll be busy running stuff, doing all, doing all of that. But yeah, if this is the end of the video, because I really don't know at this point. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed the event. And uh, yeah, if you came out, thanks for coming out. Thanks for supporting the channel. Thanks for supporting us. And thanks for supporting the haunt. Have a good one.